right, folks, welcome back to another exciting episode of Adventures in Dog Training with American Standard Dog Training and American Overwatch Canine Services. Now, check this out. This is Miss Beautiful Jojo. She is a German short-haired pointer, and she is what we would call in it to win it. Now, I got hot dogs falling from my hands, so she's ready to rock and roll. We are going to teach her today. She already knows free shaping. She's a free shaping queen. But we're going to put this down on the ground. She's never seen this before till now. I'm holding it in my hand. I'm going to put it on the floor, and the game will begin. We're going to teach her to, we're going to go ahead and teach her to put her nose on that. She has no idea. Let's see how quickly she learns. And then we're going to show you how we, basically how they teach dolphins how to jump out of the water. So let's get her back in it. Jojo! Hey, good girl! All right, let's make it happen without further introduction. Oh, my God. You would think we taught this to her before. Now, why did she do that? It's the only thing new in the environment, right? There's nothing out here. Me and hot dogs. There you go. See how quickly she learns that. Perfect. That time I waited for her nose to actually touch the red part. She does not know the game yet. She's learning. That was, you can see how that clicked for her, literally. Let's see if she gets it this time. A little low, right? So I want her to touch the, the red thing, not the low part. So we're going to make a little adjustments on the fly. Oh, yeah, girly. Oh, yeah. She's going to get fat on some hot dogs. Checking out a little bit. There's some hot dog residue on the ground. We'll give her some time. Throw it this way. See how quickly she got conditioned to running that way? We'll switch it up. Oops, she lost it. Nice, baby, nice. Might be a little high. Let's see how she does with this. It's what we call a bridge too far. I'm going to leave it there so she gets real consistent with that. A little higher. Oh, yeah. See how she struggled with that one. Oh, fuck. Let's go with it. Really changed the picture on her, didn't I? Her nose is getting the better of her. Nice. Now the point of what we're trying to teach is can I get her to jump in the air? So I'm gonna go just a little higher. Nice. Now me and Miss Jojo don't train that much, so. Oh, I think we're looking good now. Now we gotta ask for a little more from her. So this is where we gotta wait her out, let the frustration set in. Let her know that there's nothing free on the floor for you. You wanna get paid? You gotta figure out how to touch that. I'll cheat it a little lower. Beautiful. She didn't touch it, but she, she got her paws off the ground. Could have almost been a jackpot. This might be a, you know, a mini jackpot if she gets it. Two pieces. You think we can get her a little higher? Stand up. Hold on. Oh, another two pieces. Totally changed the picture on her now. See how that little change of picture 
messed her up. But we're going to wait it out. We made the decision. We're going to stick with it. Let the frustration set in. And if we have to, we can go back down. She's just looking for some free stuff. She's not quite as hungry as I'd like her or, or as motivated. There's a lot of distractions out here. A little freaked out by the camera, maybe. No cheating the, the free ones. Got to put the work in. Let's get her back in that rhythm. We got a jackpot coming, but I need her to get real high. Maybe one or two more reps and we will call it. Put a little movement to it. Activate some of that prey drive. Now she didn't touch it, but we are getting some, I need her now to get up and touch it. Good job, good job. Perfect. Seeing that shadow. She's watching the shadow more than the ball. <laughs> Good job. When I do that, that payment for my hands, it really slows her down, see? And she's like, oh, you got food in your hand? Ah, kinda. I got food in my hand if you jump. If you jump, baby doll. All right, I'd like this to be a jackpot here. So let's make it happen, sweet thing. All right, all right. For all the marbles, we need to get some air, girl. That was it, that was it. That was it, baby. Perfect. So it's really to answer your question, come in over here. How do they teach dolphins to leap 30 feet out of the air? Very similar method, very similar method, all right? Never told her no, never yelled at her. All I simply did was free shape. If you touch this, you get paid. Now, we're not teaching her to just leap out of the water. Again, you can use this to teach a lot of cool stuff. You could teach a dog to do backflips with this. You could teach a dog to touch a light switch with this. You could teach a dog to go to place with this. Basically, it's, it's a way to position a dog or get, or get a certain type of movement. You could even, if you wanted to, teach heel position with this, how to come into heel position. So it's kind of like an extension of your hand. Sometimes we teach dogs to target our hand, or we can teach her to target a target stick. So, and that's it. Look at her in it to win it. Love and life. I think that camera's got her a little stressed out, so we'll just let her enjoy her food. That's it. Hopefully you guys learned something. There are faster ways to teach this, but it's not as we always come back to. Free shaping is a deeper form of learning. It requires a ton of patience. Uh, there's moments there where you like really, really, really want to help the dog. And that's probably the last thing you want to do is, is offer any, uh, any guidance because then the dog becomes reliant upon you to figure out their problems. No, you figure it out. I'll be here to support you. I'll be here to pay you, but it's on you to figure it out. So anyhow, what are the chances what are the chances that the next time I bring this out, tomorrow, the next day, or a week from now, and she's hungry, and she sees this, she's gonna be like, this, this is my favorite button. This is like the, uh, the slot machine lever. And it's her job to get this thing going. Once she knows that this gets the slot machine to pay her, or the vending machine, she's gonna be pulling on this like a, like a maniac. So anyhow, thank you all very much for watching. Make sure to like, share, subscribe. Check out the link in the description below if you want to learn a little bit more about our program and how you can teach your own puppy or dog to be just as good as beautiful Miss Jojo here. So thank you all again. Make sure to like, share, subscribe. We will see you on the next video.